I am passionate about the texts that I teach. I love all of them. I, we're, we're just now doing To Kill a Mockingbird, and it's just, it's just warm and fuzzy in my heart. Um, so I'm passionate about the literature. I think I'm passionate about young people, students, doing for themselves, reading for themselves, and writing for themselves. And it's not just about, you know, like, you come in, is everyone writing? Okay, everyone's writing, that's a good thing. But sometimes it is about laughing with your students, or, you know, sitting down and listening to something they have to say, or letting them say something totally off the wall, and then sort of bringing them back in, you know? I mean, it's not, it's not just about the letter B, or it's not just about the synthesis essay. I probably didn't get a philosophy of teaching till fairly recently. I mean, I've always known that I love literature and I love sharing literature with students and helping them with their writing, but I think my philosophy now is um, making students aware of social issues and social justice using literature to do it. And I think, I think that's what I do, especially in the 10th grade. That's what we do. In 10th grade, we read Lord of the Flies, which is just an amazing text about human nature and darkness and light. And then we read a book called They Poured Fire on Us from the Sky, which is a, an autobiography written by three lost boys of Sudan. And they live in San Diego now. And, um, and then, after we read that, we have one of the authors come and talk to the students, El Alfonso and Deg. Um, and that's always a really great experience, but once we do that, it makes the relationship between what they've read and what they're looking at real. Even fiction can take us to a place that's important, but, um, Nonfiction, especially, gives the kids a sense of a, a world that they're completely unfamiliar with. I think it's important for students to think about things beyond themselves. I always tell them the book is not meant to make you feel bad about the things you have. So it's not about feeling bad that you have three meals a day. It's about being aware that not everyone does and trying to find a path that allows you to pursue something you care about. Okay, I think the idea is for them to find something they're passionate about. I want them to walk out knowing that I care about them. Um, I want them to walk out with a bigger picture of the world. I want them to walk out feeling like they can read and write. Um, and I want them to walk out feeling capable of the next thing.